Okay, we've got uh, Kelsey Cottrell here, one of the leading ladies bowls player, warm bowls player. Congratulations on all your success so far, well done. Australian Open coming up. Yeah, looking forward to it. I've um, never been down this way, so it's, um, it's been fun being down here for a couple of weeks. And... How does a Queensland girl get into lawn bowls? What about surfing and swimming? And... I tried all of that. I've done everything. I still play tennis. Yep. Um, my mum started a couple of years before I did just to meet some people and probably wasn't as exciting to sit on the sideline. So I ended up having a bit of a go. So, and you've done all right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I've done, all right. I've done all right. This is my seventh year now. I can't really believe that I've been playing for seven years, but everything happened really quickly for me. What's it like? representing your country. It's absolutely unreal. I couldn't believe it. I just we played um, the world championships at the start of this year and yep. the atmosphere was just amazing like nothing I've ever experienced before. The grandstands were so high and just around all the greens and it was just amazing. And you're getting to travel a bit now as well? Yeah we are. We're um, heading to Malaysia in a, in a few months and um, the next Commonwealth Games is in India so I'm hoping to make that team and, and I'll be over in Delhi in Gurry with, the, <laughs> with all of them. At the Commonwealth Games? Yeah Commonwealth Games. Oh, best of luck with that. Now, if you started off watching your mum, what does your mum think of her little girl now? Um, my mum, sorry, she's really proud. She loves coming and watching, and um, she, you know, she still plays a bit herself. She actually just made the state team, so I've um, recently moved out. So the next time I see her will be when we represent Queensland together, which will be a bit different. Oh, she'll have a tear in her eye, no <laughs> doubt. And of course, uh, a lot of people look at lawn bowls as being an older person's game, but that is certainly changing now. Yeah, I think I was definitely guilty of that um, when my mum first started. I used to give her a bit of slack and say, what's a 40-year-old doing play bowls? And then I ended up starting at 12. But um, now it's definitely changing. There's so many young ones. and. Um, you know, it's just it's great coming away because you know the, the average the average age of the men the men's team is actually younger than the, the cricket team. Yep. So like we all just get on so great and we have so much fun and and I'm really enjoying that. They're probably going better than the men's cricket team at the moment. So who's your idol, mate? Have you got a sporting idol? Um, I actually have a few, but coming from a tennis background, I just absolutely love Roger Federer, and I had a tear in my eye in the Australian Open. But I'm also a fan of Nadal. I think he's um. Uh, the younger, sort of um, more modern and better, I guess. Yep. So I'm definitely a big tennis fan, and, and bowls wise, um, I've grown up watching Karen Murphy. She she sort of done what I did when when she was a teenager, and um, as, yeah, she's always good to have a chat to. And what's your main goal? I mean, from now, three years from now, what would you have loved to achieve in the next three years? Um, I think after the, my World Bowls experience, I made the semi-final and I lost um, on the last end in circumstances that I don't want to talk about. <laughs> well, we won't. So I definitely want to. Um, I definitely want to. Um, Make the Commonwealth Games team in 2010 and win a gold medal there, and then back it up in Adelaide in the 2010, uh, 2012, sorry, at the World Championships on home, on home soil. It'd just be amazing to win a gold medal there. Well, I have no doubt that you'll do it. You're uh, flying the flag for the Aussies, and you're doing a great job for yourself. Congratulations so far, and best of luck in the future. Thank you. Thanks, Kelsey.